Innovation is everywhere. It's all about the hot, the new, the shiny stuff, isn't it? Well, it can be about that, Kai, but I think, you know, more than that, I think it's really how do you get the value out of the innovation at the end of the day? And that's why we've kind of rested our hats on applied innovation. It's a difference there. But at the same time, what we've got to try to do is to still create certainty, permanency, and the outcomes we're looking for. And I think that's where some of the basics of, of what we've all practiced for so long come into play, like architecture. I think architecture is very important that way. So what we were challenged with oftentimes is, is how do you, in a world of agility and new things coming at a faster pace, how do you architect in new ways that you don't restrict yourself, but you more kind of open up the possibilities? So that's what we call architecting for change. Taking the good, the stable, the foundational stuff that we've been working on for the last 20 years um, and coupling it marrying it up with the, the new, it is the architecting for change. Solidifying the right things that are foundational and being dynamic uh, and uh, agile on the things that, that we need to be to uh, achieve our goals.